There are still two months left for the IIT exam, and whenever I go on Telegram, Reddit, or YouTube, I see new students every day who have just learned about ISERs and are wandering around, unsure of where and how to prepare. So I thought of making a video on this topic. So I am bringing this video in three parts. First, I will talk about those students who will take this exam in 2025. Then I will discuss about those. Who will take this exam in 2026, and finally those appearing in 2027. So this will be the first part of the series, and I hope it will help you all. First, I will divide the 2025 aspirants into three categories. The first category includes those who have already prepared well for JE or NEET, have completed the syllabus, and now want to study specifically for IIT in this two months. The second category consists of students who are in JEE, NEET, or IIT coaching but have not completed the syllabus properly and have backlogs of a good number of chapters. The third category includes those who have only done regular school studies and now want to clear IIT within two months. Look, I will be very honest in this video. Before starting, I want to make it clear that this is not a paid promotion. I will give you honest and genuine answers. And openly mention different companies and coaching institutes. But remember, this is not a paid promotion. If in future I ever do a paid promotion, I will mention it for sure. Now, let's talk about the first category: students who have done JE or NEET coaching well and have almost no backlog. I mean, almost everyone has a backlog of one or two chapters, so I am neglecting that. But if you have a backlog of Uh, I mean, good chapters like thermodynamics or I mean kinematics. Uh, like th they are very good chapters and they carry a good number of uh, questions. So I mean, you have to do those chapters first, right? So I was talking about those students who have done J or NEET coaching well and have almost no backlog. So since you have prepared well with good number of question practice, you should now focus only on solving previous year's questions for IIT. The topics are the same. The difference lies in the question pattern and difficulty level. See, I know you might be tired of hearing this thing that you should focus on uh, solving previous year's question. See, I am going to tell you a good method that I did in my time. So please listen to this. See, I suggest you to practice the last two years' questions first and check if you can solve most of them. If you can, great. Keep revising and practicing. If not. Start solving similar questions with a similar difficulty level before moving on other years' question papers. I mean, it's a great thing. I mean, if you do this, I think it might be very helpful for you. So yeah, uh, you can do this. Now, I don't think you need to buy any separate test series. If you find a free one, you can take it without a stress. But buying one is unnecessary. So if you can find a uh, free test series, you can give it. Uh, it will be beneficial, but you don't have to buy any other test series. If you have given good test series of JE or NEET, then it's okay. I mean, you don't need to have buy separate test series for either exam. I mean, it's 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 good. I mean, uh, solving previous year's questions are enough. Now let's talk about those who have backlogs. Backlogs. I mean, a good number of backlogs. If your backlog is from 11 great chapters, check out the Arjuna J YouTube channel. They have a playlist where excellent teachers have covered entire chapters in one-shot lectures. And since these are recorded lectures, you won't waste much time. Yes, the lectures might feel a bit long, but you have enough time. And since only a few of your chapters have backlog, you can cover them easily. By the way, the playlist links are in the description box. You can check it there. For 12th great chapters. You should refer to Physics Wala's Manzil batch from this year because I could not find better recorded lectures on YouTube. These teachers are top notch. I mean, they teach really well. I personally uh, watch their lectures because I mean, I want to I want to share my personal experiences because I don't want to just recommend anything to you. So those lectures are helpful and uh, those lectures cover almost. Almost uh, all of the topics of IIT. So, I mean, you can uh, rely on that without a doubt. And for biology, I recommend this playlist for zoology uh, by Samapti Mem. And for botany, Vipin Sir's lectures are the best of this playlist. 
I have watched many lectures before recommending them to you. I mean, I have done a lot of lectures from them. So, I can surely say that uh, they are the best. Once you are done with all of this, start solving previous year's questions like the first category. Now, let's talk about students with average preparation who want to focus only on IIT preparation now. Honestly, time is very limited, but it's not impossible. Currently, two YouTube channels are providing IIT specific courses. One is Sayastra and two is ClassPay. Sayastra is very old and I mean, they are one of the one of the oldest channels who are promoting Isers and ClassPay is new YouTube channel. So yeah, they are also providing IIT courses. Both channels are offering free crash courses on YouTube and their content is quite good. You can choose either one by watching a chapter and seeing which one you can understand better. But don't waste too much time in deciding which one to choose. However, one key difference is that Sayastra provides live lectures and ClassPay provides recorded lectures. I always prefer recorded lectures because they save time. But it's your choice. If you have less time, recorded sessions are better. But again, it's up to you. No one is paying me to say this. So yes, from what I have heard, previous year's questions will be covered in the classes. So don't worry about that. For students with PCM or PCB, you can clear IIT with three subjects and still get into a good ISER. However, if you want to take the exam with all four subjects, this courses will help you to solve a good number of questions and it will help you to build a good concept. So for PCM and PCB students, you can do your math or biology from this courses because I mean they are doing quite good so you can do this. So uh, this is it. I mean I have tried to bring all the points and I have tried to explain it in a better way. So my last suggestion would be please start preparing now. Stop wandering around and wasting time. Otherwise you will regret it later for sure. Anyway, I hope this video helped you. Hit the like button, subscribe for more amazing content. Bye.